Hello everyone, Machu Picchu here, and today we are here with another Siren Head game. I have heard nothing but good things about this Siren Head game. Um, it apparently has a story to it, and a lot of people just really like the game, and I really do like Siren Head. He has been a very interesting thing on this channel, and I would like to continue playing the games. So uh, we'll go ahead and get into this one, and we'll see what all the hype is about. So, school is over and my friends want me to go camping with them. I don't really like camping, but you know, my friend said, Hey Freddy, you never hang out with us, you are always at home playing the Atari. What? The Atari? That's an old game system. Well, I did just get my driver's license, may as well go and have some fun. Hey, it's the first day of summer, South Point Meadows, here I come. Okay, here we are. Oh. Welcome to South Point Meadows. It's dark out here, so use F to use your flashlight and press E to interact with objects. Don't shine your flashlight too long. It could irritate people or some things. Also, use R to ping your next objective if you get lost. Got it. Okay, well that's pretty cool, so that way we don't have to just wander aimlessly around in the forest and make this take a massive amount of time. See, this right here, this is why I will never go camping. Although, to be completely honest, I wouldn't go camping anyways. I'm not a, I'm not much of a camping person. Okay, there appears to be a camp right here. This must be where our friends are. Campsite. Oh, is that blood? Oh my god. Press C key to crouch. Use this ability to get into tight areas, or if you get stuck around short trees, crouching can set you free. Got it. Officials say they are currently looking for them and may take some time. One of them enjoyed camping and is a hunter, so if you find any missing campers gear in South Point Meadows Park, please call the authorities immediately. Oh! I forgot to mention that the person that we are playing is a high schooler who was supposed to obviously go camping with his friends. When he shows up, he doesn't understand or know where they could have gone. I forgot to mention at the beginning of the video, I'm sure you figured it out from what we've seen so far, but I just wanted to go ahead and throw that in there so that way there's some more context to this story. Also, outside of our complex, we have some outside work being done, so if you hear some weird noises, that's probably what that is. Um, or it could be Siren Head, I don't know. I'm not going to look out the window and see if Siren Head's outside my window because that would be absolutely terrifying. No thank you. Do I hear creaking? Okay. Oh no, I already hear him. Okay, that or I heard some sort of weird growling elephant dog thing. Which is probably, probably just as terrifying as Siren Head, honestly. You know, I've been having a lot of fun playing all these Siren Head games. They really are creative. I'm really glad that someone decided to add a story to one of them like this. This really makes me like... Oh, okay. Okay. This really makes me like these kinds of games when they add a story to it. I hope they continue to make games like this with more stories. Oh, that sounds like the Siren Head. Well, you can't get me if I'm on a tall tower, I hope. It's a radio. Looks like the radio is down. There should be a cellar or underground place that we need to go to. Okay. Turn on radio tower. To equip the rifle, press 2 key on the keyboard. Press it again to put it away. You need to load each shot to use this. That can be done by pressing R to reload your next shot. Keep in mind that you can only hold one item at a time. So that means we can't hold the flashlight and the gun at the same time. Okay. Officials believe that the body that was found is that of John Parker, one of the four missing friends from the local high school. They say his body was torn apart by some immense force. Possibly hit that. Oh, that sounds terrible. His body was torn apart. His body was torn apart from an immense force. It sounds terrifying. Really don't like that we can hear Mr. Siren Head already. We haven't even been here that long, and he's already making himself known. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Okay, guess we need to just continue heading towards the... Ooh, almost got stuck. 
But that would be okay because we can crouch to unstuck if I'm not wrong. What's that? Oh. Oh, please don't be in front of me. Oh, please don't be in front of me. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. What? What? Where is he? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. No, no, no. Okay. Oh, gosh. Wait, what happened? Okay. What? What's happening? Did we get smushed under the ground? Oh, my gosh, guys. I think we're stuck. We're stuck. Okay. Um, well, this is a little bit weird. Why are we stuck on the ground? I am so confused. Did he smush us into the ground? Oh, that sounds terrifying. Maybe he broke our legs. Um. Okay. That's a little bit weird. Um. Oh my god, Sarah, is that you? Oh gosh, oh gosh! Okay, well, he got us. Huh. So, the first time he broke our legs, and then the second time he killed us. Why did that happen? Okay, so how do we avoid him the second time he comes around? Because, well actually, how do we avoid him the first time? I don't want him to crush our legs again. That was so bizarre when that happened. Maybe it was a button I pressed. That's jumping. That's crouch. Oh, Z. Okay. Well, that's a little weird. Um. So when he starts running at us, do we need to press Z in order to survive? Well, when I was laying on the ground the last time, he... He still killed us. Oh, there he is. Okay. So we're going to try it. Hopefully this works. Okay. Okay, okay, so that's how we get away from him. So in order to get away from him, we have to press Z and lay on the ground. I wonder why that works. That's a little weird. I don't remember reading anything in his uh, wiki page that would tell me. That, that would even remotely have a chance of working. That sounded terrifying. Okay, this is where we got last time. Okay, there's Sarah. Yep, okay. What's this? Now I just need to get back to the tower and call for help. Okay. Officials have said after a month of searching, the kids can't be found. It is ruled out that one of the friends, Freddie Anderson, lured them out to the forest because he felt like they were holding him back in high school. That's right, Freddie. We all know what you did. So now they think that I killed them because they think they think that I thought that they were holding me back in school. Siren Head, why do you have to play dirty? I didn't kill those people. It was you. You and your weird siren. Okay, I hear him. Maybe if I run this way? Okay. Yeah, it sounds like he's far away. So we don't have to worry about him right now. Running up to me. All we have to do, come on. Okay, finally. Gosh. Hello, this is Austin Kirkland. We hear you loud and clear. We will be giving you instructions on how to get to safety. This is the old ranger station radio frequency, so we know where you are. We will be dispatching officers as soon as we can, but as you know, we can't get into that area very easily, so you'll have to do some legwork yourself. There is a bridge near you, down the roadways. We can't get our cruisers past that point, so you will have to meet us there. Once you make it there, we will bring you home. Don't run out. Okay. 
Wait, I can see him. He thinks he can feed his friends. Get a load of this guy. If I were him, I would just lay down on my back and wait. Wait for what you say? Do it and you will find out. Give up. Press Z to lay down. Okay, this is when I was supposed to find out about that. Okay, so by laying down, when he chases you, he thinks you are just giving up. So as long as we lay down every time he chases us, we should be okay. So let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and go to um, the bridge. Okay, well... Oh, it sounds so terrifying. Why does there have to be something that growls like that? Is he coming for us? Okay. Okay. It sounds like he's not coming for us right now. Which is a good thing. Because I really don't want him to be chasing me. Okay. Um. Alright, here's the bridge. Why does it tell me to go up into the sky? Wait. The bridge is broken. Oh no. Okay, we need to go around. We need to go around. Okay. 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 Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Where is he? Why did he stop moving? Oh, that's that's so suspicious. Something weird's going on here. I do not trust that one bit. Where is he at? I'm keeping my thumb on the Z button right now. You try to come over here and I'll lay down right on my stomach. Okay, we made it to the other side of the bridge. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, so um, I guess we should just keep running on this road until we see help, maybe? I don't know. Oh, please. Please let there be somebody down here that is willing to help me immediately. Hopefully some of those rangers are already here. Or better yet, just bring the whole military. Bring a tank. Probably a helicopter with missiles. Just anything that can shoot big, explosive things would be great. Why did the screen just shake? That was weird. Hmm. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's getting near. Okay. See, again, this is why you don't go camping. This is why camping is always a bad idea. This right here. Because this stuff. Oh no. Oh no. Oh please. Oh please. How far is this road? Where are the cops? I hope I'm not going the wrong way. That would really suck to find out. That all this time, we have been heading the wrong way. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry that I doubted you. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm almost free, just gotta follow this path. Okay, okay. So, this is the correct path to go onto. Something in my eye. Okay, there. Well, there's dramatic music playing. I have zero bullets all of a sudden. What happened to my ammo? Maybe I was supposed to shoot him a few times. Huh. That's weird. Okay, well, I still don't see anything. Are we sure this is... Oh, I see the police stuff! Okay, go, 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 go! Oh no, oh no, he's right behind me, isn't he? Wait. Wait, what? What? No, no, we were tricked. The police aren't here. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, just gotta keep going. Oh, please let there be somebody over here. Wait a minute. Feels like this road just goes on for- We're stuck! We're stuck here! Oh no! Oh no! We're stuck! Oh, that's not good. Okay, um... Where do we need to go to get out of here? Oh, it goes beyond the siren. Or the police lights. 
Was I supposed to... Just stand here. Ooh! Oh gosh! Okay! Well, that was weird. He wasn't able to kill me. Alright guys, I walked around for a little bit and uh, all it did whenever I walked back was take me back to the bridge and there was nothing at the bridge. So I walked all the way back to the police car and there was no police car. So um, I'm not sure if my game glitched out or if I guess the game is saying that you're stuck here forever kind of thing. Not totally sure, but anyways, that was still really cool that they added a story to this game and I hope that they continue to add one to future Siren Head games. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and the content in it, consider like, subscribing, and letting me know in the comments down below as it greatly helps me out. Also, make sure to hit that notification bell as we upload every single day. Thank you guys once again. I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.